Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel where we explore the world of beekeeping, baby goats, and more. Where you can also learn from my many failures so you won't make the same mistakes I have. Hit that like button and subscribe if you enjoy this video, please. Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. We're gonna, today we're going to talk about um, beekeeping equipment, right? Uh, a lot of people know, you know, have been watching videos on beekeeping. I know I did. 2017, 18, 19, I really wanted to get into it. In 2020, I was able to finally actually get into beekeeping. Um, and I've learned a lot the past four or five years. I will say that um, one of the things that prohibits a lot of people from getting into beekeeping is the beekeeping equipment, right? They, um, you know, it's these 10 frame uh, boxes, for instance, are 180 bucks on Amazon. So you're talking about two, three of those, you got $600 in without any bees. So it's, it's a pretty good investment. And one thing that I've always um, been trying to figure out is how do I get more beekeeping equipment? How, how do I scale upwards without, you know, with, without making it a commercial business or anything like that? Hey, I just want to do a little side hobby. I want to be able to uh, provide some honey for my family. I want to be able to, um, I want to be able to give some to family and friends and, you know, without it making, without being 60, 70 hives deep, and having to you know, try to make money on the business, I want to be a hobby beekeeper with 15, 20 hives, where you know I can sell a little bit, I can you know give some to family and friends to you know charity or whatever I need to do. So, so one of the things I figured out is that people want to invest in a journey, uh, especially when you're a beekeeper, you're doing something to try to change the environment to some extent. Um, and so you know people on LinkedIn and YouTube even were like, hey, you know, what about being a bee sponsor, a beehive sponsor? And so. That's what I started looking into. And so essentially, I, I um, put the offer out there and I've had seven people so far sign up for it. And I've sent out you know some batches of honey to them and I'm going to uh, continue to do that. And I'm going to uh, even put their logo on the hive itself after I get done building it. Um, it'll probably go right up front here. You know what else, bring this one out. I need to actually build a lean-to right here to cover all the beekeeping equipment. I'm getting there. Anyway, so I'm going to put the uh, logo, their business, right up front here. Do a little advertising for them. And I'm going to send them some honey in exchange for the equipment. Um, anyway, all that to say, there's different ways, right? There's different, there's different things you can do to be able to, you know, fulfill your dreams of, you know, becoming a beekeeper and becoming... Um, you know, a hobby, uh, even if it's just your hobby, becoming a hobby beekeeper and being able to, you know, scale up a little bit, a little bit more, get those bees. Like next year, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a bunch of swarm traps out and hopefully catch, you know, 10 to 20 swarms. You know, put them in these hives. And that way, instead of having six hives, five or six hives, I'm able to um, scale it up to 20, 25 hives and be able to um, produce that much more honey help my crops over here. I don't really have crops for say my vegetable garden and everything else. And my neighbor across the way, about a mile away, you know, has a big garden, um, I mean, much bigger than mine. But at the end of the day, all that to say, there's all sorts of ways you can, you know, you can get beekeeping equipment without having to pay for it fully, right? I'll probably be out 70, 80 bucks in honey. Um, and then you're making that little logo. So I basically, I'm getting the hive for half price, right? But that's something I'm able to keep without having to come out of pocket, you know, three grand at once, four grand at once to get all this beekeeping equipment. So I want you to uh, just take that with what you will and um, try to, uh, try to you know, keep pursuing your passion of beekeeping or whatever it is. But the main, the main thing I want you to understand is the fact that if you're passionate about something and you're connected to a larger audience, um, you know, just, you know, even Facebook friends, that kind of stuff. People want to invest in you and people want to help you with your journey. Uh, so anyway, enough talking. Go ahead and watch me put all these together.
uh, now all seven of them are put together. I have another one in the box still that someone else just did late. Um, but now I have, you know, eight, uh, ten frame beehives complete, ready to go when I start catching swarms in the spring. Um, but anyway, the main point of this video is to never underestimate the fact that people want to invest in what you're passionate about. So just remember that, you know, if you only have, if you have zero hives or you have, you know, 10, 20 hives and you're struggling to scale upwards or whatever you need to do, um, just remember that people are willing to invest in you and people are willing to say, hey, you know, trade me some honey and, you know, um, a shout out for my business like right here uh, and, and I'm willing to, you know, buy you a hive or two. So anyway, I hope you take that uh, from the video and I hope you realize, hey, there's all sorts of ways to grow your beekeeping adventure. Anyway, see you next time.